Happy Memorial Day, YouTubers! This is Michael Stymates here. Today I'm about to start up with this box set of Star Trek The Movie's 25th Anniversary Collector Sets. Huh. Well, this is a very exciting movies of Star Trek that I've seen it before because I'm a huge fan of Star Trek since... 1995 because the first one I saw was the Star Trek IV The Voyage Home because it was way exciting movie. And we have this picture it was the cruise of the Enterprise. We have Captain James T. Kirk. Here's Spock, Dr. McCoy, Scotty, Uhura, and here's Sulu and Chekhov. Yeah, that was very good. The grooves I saw, and here we have these three, five. I mean, five of those films of Star Trek movies, and here we have five VHSs of Star Trek movies. We have Star Trek: The Motion Picture, Star Trek: Two: The Wrath of Khan. Star Trek 3 The Search for Spock, and Star Trek 4 The Voyage Home, and Star Trek 5 The Final Frontier. Here's the Enterprise. That was a famous ship of Star Trek that I have ever seen that before. It's called the Enterprise. It looks so amazing. Let's pull this thing out and see what's happening. And here we got these... Four, I mean five of those movies of Star Trek. Next up, I mean, the first one we got was Star Trek The Motion Picture. was the special longer version of it. Look at this. We have Captain Kirk with, with Spock and Ilea. Very amazing movie because here we got the spine. We have it says a Paramount Pictures logo. And here's the back. Special longer version. 12 minutes of intentional footage. Huh. Amazing picture I see before. That was very amazing. Wow, very exciting movie. I've ever seen that before. And here we got the Star Trek the Motion Picture Special Longer Version, 1980, but that year is wrong. 143 minutes, rated G, in stereo. And here we have this ad for the inserts. Here's a sticker label. Here's the end label, and it's nothing. And here we got the next one. We got Star Trek II, The Wrath of Khan. <laughs> that quote I heard, Khan, you bloodsuckers! <laughs> oh, looks like Kirk was mad at Khan. I seen that part where he yelled, Con! Oh! He's mad. <laughs> that was a very exciting movie. Here we have got the spine. And here's the top. Star Trek II, No Wrath of Khan. 1982, 113 minutes, and rated PG. Arch-villain Khan returns to set a deadly trap for Kirk. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, the Enterprise is under attack by the Reliant because... <laughs> wow, that was a best scene. <laughs> it's a very exciting movie. And here we got the sticker label. And the end label. And, hold on a second.
31st, 33rd week of 1991. Next up, here's Star Trek 3, The Search for Spock. Whoo! I love this artwork. It was so beautiful. Here we have, underneath there, we got Captain Kirk with Savick. And... Dr. McCoy, Sulu, and Jekyll. I don't know what that name is. And here we have on the side, on the top, we have a face of Spock. <laughs> wow, look at that. And here we have the Enterprise is being attacked by the bird of prey. The Klingon bird of prey. <laughs> Here's the spine. Top says Star Trek III, The Search for Spock, 1984 in color. 105 minutes. That movie came out before Ghostbusters. Kirk must battle the Klingons to protect Genesis planet and save his friend's life. Hmm. Yeah, that was a very exciting movie. And now, here we got the sticker label, the end label, 33rd week of 1991. And finally, next up, we got Star Trek IV The Voyage Home. <laughs> that was another exciting movie. This is a very good movie. I have ever seen that before. And here's the top. 1986 in color, 119 minutes, rated PG. Can the crew of the Starship Enterprise save the Earth and its people from total destruction. Wow, that was very exciting movie. I seen that one where the probe has came to Earth and it's losing power. This is way, way exciting and I and I'm thinking Katherine Hicks is in that movie because she plays Dr. Jillian Taylor. Uh, I like that one when he says she's pregnant. But unfortunately, she stops the car. <laughs> that was very, very funny. And here is the sticker label. And the end label. And here's... Print date is August 10th, 1991. And 33rd week of 1991. And finally, next up... Here's Star Trek V, The Final Frontier. Hmm. That movie is worst. Just because we have all those guys with the horses are all charging up to the castle. This is way, way bad. Hmm. Here's a spine. The top says Star Trek V, The Final Frontier. 1989, 1989 in color, 107 minutes, rated PG. The Final Frontier has the treks in sense in spades, says David Einstein. Net news week. This is way amazing. Huh. It's directed by William Shatner. And here we got the sticker label, the end label, 33rd week of 1991. And I'll be right there where I'm just about to get another one. Because this that I got was Star Trek VI, The Undiscovered Country. Ooh, this artwork is so amazing. I love it. Because this is the return of Michael Dorn as Lieutenant, as Worf. Hmm. 1981 in color, 110 minutes, rated PG. Huh. And look at this picture. Whoa! Spock is doing something for Valerance's mine. 
That was so exciting. <laughs> it's super exciting movie. This is very, very good. And here we have the sticker label. And here's the end label. And 35th week of 1992. All right, that's it for today. This is Michael Stimey saying peace and God bless us, YouTube, and have a happy Memorial Day. Bye.